Uncle Frank? What? Can I ask you something? What? What is it? I need money. Why do you need money? I need money for a snow cone. It's too cold. So I don't even think anyone's anyone is out now. Too cold? What are you talking about? Everybody loves snow cones in summer. It's summer and I want a snow cone. Please, what do you mean it's summer? Please. It's like November. And you know daily savings time it ends tomorrow. Day daylight what? What's daylight savings time? Well every year in the summer like or well in the spring on March thirteenth we change the clocks one hour earlier to save the energy so people because sunset is at 7 30 and people are up till 10 sunrise is at 4 30 in the morning oh, and people wake up at like six you're so, gonna change uh, the clock so people so they shift it so sun set is now 8 30 and then it's and, and then uh, the, the sun rises at 5.30, so it's only a little bit of darkness people are up and a little bit of brightness people are sleeping. Oh, well, I don't understand any of that, but I don't want to change the clocks. Let's just leave it the way you it is. You gotta stick to the society. What do you mean? You gotta fit into the society. You mean everybody does this? Yes. I don't want to. Let's leave it alone, I think. No, no. But what I... What happens if we have an appointment at 8.30 and then on the clock it says 7.30 and then we're going to be late? It's too confusing. You do what you want. You and I didn't love about go change the clocks. I'm yeah, not, gonna I'm not going to be two in, We're going to stay up till 2 in the morning. So, uh, But it's 9 o'clock. you got to go to bed. Ugh. I don't like daylight, whatever. Go to bed. Good night, Uncle Frank. So... What do you want to do, Bo? Well, well, let's hang out here until 2 in the morning. What are we going to do at 2? We're going to change the clocks, remember? Oh, yeah, yeah, the, the daylight savings thing, right? Yes. Cool, so we'll wait till 2 a.m., change the clocks, and then I guess go to bed? Yes. Cool, what do you want to do? Well, let's just hang out here. You want to play 20 questions or something? Yeah. Six hours later. Well, yo, it's three. Yeah, it's three o'clock now. Do you know how to change that thing? Yes, uh, so we need to go back to two. All right, do, do the change thing. So... All right, so now this clock's changed. Let's Go to the next clock in the other room. Get a device. What time is it? Um, it says 3.02, but I guess we change it to 2.02. All right, so 2.02. Remember that. 2.02. Change it to 2.02. You're good at that, bro. All right. Okay, that's another clock. How many more we got? Like five more. Whoa, let's get busy. I want to go to sleep soon. So it... Two, two o five, right? Yes. Can so. you change it, bro? Yeah. All right. Cool. Let's finish this up before Mario wakes right. up. Cool. I don't want to make too much noise. Come on. All right. Change it. Just go around. Everything needs to get changed. Your hand looks so human lately. Yeah. You need to lose weight. Your hand is starting to look a little human. Yeah. All right. This one's done. Good job, Franco. Mm -hmm. I think we got one more. Yeah, one more. All right. Here's the last one. Finally. It's getting late, bro. Uh, uh. Yeah. Hand looks so human lately. Alright. Alright. So, what do you think? Oh, yeah. Let's, let's go to bed now. Yeah, finally. Night. Bye. Bye. I don't want 
Uncle Frank or Aunt Lobo to hear me. I don't believe in that daylight savings malarkey. It's a whole big bunch of baloney. I'm gonna change the clock back and nobody's gonna know the difference. That way we'll be back to regular time and I could get my snow cone. Let me change it now. Okay, that should do it. Yeah, better. Now that's the real time. Not that crazy time that everybody changed it to. Let me get all the rest of the clocks in the house and we'll be back to the regular time. No more of this crazy. More to go. Let's change this one now. And press that button. And we're back to regular Mario time. I'm so smart. Nobody's gonna know. And we won't ever have to do that daylighty thing that Uncle Frank was talking about. And I'm gonna get my snow cone. This has gotta be one of the last clocks in the house. Let me change this whole clock here. Bingo, bazango, bazonga. And the clock is back to Mario time. Snow cone, here I come. I'm going back to bed. No one will ever know. some big news for you, Frank. What? Oh, pay attention. You're gonna really like uh, this, boss. All right, check it out, boss. You, you know I work down at the carrot factory, right? Yeah. Well, guess who loves fresh carrot juice in the morning and who's making a commercial for us at 12 noon today? Who? Your favorite artist in the whole world, Mud. Donna. I gotta come there. What time is it? Don't don't worry. Well, I got more news for you, boss. She asked for you. She knew who I was and, and and knew that you used to do those episodes with me. And she said, "Can you have Frank come to the set for the carrot commercial? Because she wants to work with you and write a song with you and and and, and collaborate on some music with you. Because she loved the '50s music and." and all of your old songs. But, there's one catch. What's the catch? Don't be late. Everybody knows Madonna does not tolerate lateness. Don't even be one minute late because if you're late, she ain't never gonna talk to you again. Okay, we had one right. assistant who was like five minutes late with her flowers and, and she threw a all fit. Right, don't be late, don't be late, okay. What time is I it, you it. remember? 12, 12 noon. noon, right. Show up. This is going to be your big break. Uh, You're going to work with Madonna. Yay! I'm so proud of you, Frank. See right. you later at noon. It, it takes 45 minutes to get there. It's already 11 now, so let me leave 15 minutes early in case the train's late or something. All right, I'm, I'm going now. Okay, I'm dead. Bobo? Where is everyone? Studio Club. Don't never want to work with you ever well, again. 
Yeah, and we waited for like 20 minutes. She never waits even five minutes. Well, she was so mad. Oh, the bro, thing is, what did you Mario do? Mario the Boy. Brat changed the clocks from day because he didn't like daylight savings. So it said one there, and I was supposed to go there at 12. Boss, uh, she don't want to hear no excuses. I got to go home and yell at Mario. She said she's never going to work with you ever, ever again, boss. What did you do, boss? It was Mario's fault. Bye. Uncle Frank's going to be so proud of me that I fixed the whole clock situation. Maybe he'll give me two snow cones. Can't wait till he get. What? That sounds like an angry knock. Come in, Uncle Frank. He's going to give me a reward, probably, for fixing the whole snow cone situation. What? 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 Why are you so angry, Uncle Frank? You're scaring me. Say something. What, what happened? Stop looking at me like that, Uncle Frank. off Madonna. She doesn't want to talk to me or talk to you ever again. What did you do? Why were you late? I don't understand. It That's not that like Mario. you. It's not like you though, bro. Why? I'll hang up. It was so unprofessional. Why 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 did you do that? Did you do that? That's so unprofessional. Frank, you an adult, you should be responsible for yourself. Mario, get in here and apologize to Bobo about what you did. Are you going to yell at me more? Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Uh, I wanted a snow cone. Well, I wanted two. So I changed all the clocks in the house and you're just going to... I changed all the clocks back to regular time. I don't like daylight time. Wasn't that smart, I guess? Are you saying I messed up? Oh my yes, oh, yes, God! Oh, oh, oh. Aunt Lobo, I never seen you like that. Your eyebrows. You know, why are you so, oh, oh, don't hurt me. Yes, oh, you oh, oh, oh. Oh. I'm sorry. I didn't know. No, I said oh, I oh, oh, oh. Uh, Frank, uh, McDonald's so angry at me, I got fired. I got fired from my carrot job. Uh, Mario, get back and come here. Mario? Oh, uh, pulling the ears. The uh, boss, why, why are you yelling at Mario? It's not his fault that I got fired, is it? He changed the clock. 
I got you fired? Uh, I lost my job. Uh, I got a kid on the way and my wife is mad at me. I, I can't eat no more carrots now. Uh, you got you, I got fired, No Mario. choice for, for one and a half years. Oh, no. I don't want that. I'm throwing all your toys in the garbage. No, not in the garbage. Just throw them under the bed. Too bad. Uh, I got fired. I am very angry, Mario. I'm angry too. That Mario messed everything up. Mario, I'm gonna get you, Mario. 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 Mario, get back him. I'm scared. No, I'm staying here. Get here! French boy, you in? Come on. How dare you do that? Why would you do that, Mario? Uh, all because I wanted more snow cone. Isn't that called child abuse? It doesn't no, matter what you no, no. I am very angry! We are very angry! Help! I've never seen anybody this angry before. Madonna's angry at you and, and yeah. Bobo I'm got fired. Up. Get my arms! No. <laughs> no, you're gonna hurt me. I won't! Yeah. Get in my arm. Let me hurt him first. Uh, I can. I got fun. We're all gonna kill him. No, no. guys, why can't you reconsider? Stop, stop what you're doing. Yeah. The uh, boss, uh, he's hanging. What do you want to do with him now? Uh, should we kill him? Uh, we can't kill him. That's against the law. Uh, should we set him on fires? Uh, guys, can you please reconsider? I know you're angry at me. And Madonna is not speaking to you. Well, 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 Bobo, let's look at this at the sky. <laughs> Uncle Bobo, I'm sorry I got you fired. And... Let's look at the sky, Bobo, and Lobo's just gonna come, and Lobo's gonna yell at you. I think, the boss, I think uh, we should take his clothes off and throw him in a fire, fireball, like uh, one of those witch's pots that's got the bur boiling water, and we drop him in there. Can we do that? Is that uh, illegal? No, you don't want to do that, uh, Uncle Bobo. Why don't you just spank me like once? That would be... That would be satisfying, right? I'm speaking you! Uh, ow, uh, ow. You pussy. No choice for 10 years! I really messed up this time, didn't I? Get in your room! <laughs> I've never seen anybody. No exception! Boys, I really don't like Mario. He messed Let's up watch the sky my job. Together. Mario's really making me annoyed today. I'm too angry. Let's just watch the sky together. I'm too angry, boys. I think I want to go kill Mario. Now you can't kill him, Bobo. He's just a stupid kid. He don't know better. What should we do about this? He's not even... I'm done about this! I'm going in my room. I'm done. Let's talk. Yeah, Frank? It looks like a Lobo left. He yeah, was... Yeah, Frank, uh, he's not even your kid, right? Yeah. Uh, nobody knows where Mario's real parents are. Should we put him on fire? Uh, I thought about that, but I looked it up. Uh, you're not allowed to do that. Wicked gets uh, in jail. Uh, maybe... 
idea. Oh, oh, I got an idea, Frank. Why don't we ask him to leave? We could kick him out of using low. That's a good idea. I mean, he could just be homeless and walk around the street all by himself. Yeah, I'm gonna call him in here, but I'm gonna take off my eyebrows and. Mario! Mario, get in here! Are you gonna hit me? Mario! We ain't gonna I hit you, Mario. I have something to tell you, though. Uh, should I leave, Frank? No, get stupid. You, you need to come here, though. Look. Oh, now that music? Ugh. Well, well, look. Well, here's a decision that the three of us, actually the two of us made. Well, Lobo's was done for the day. He, he really got pissed off because of you, so... I know I messed up this time. So you got I it. always mess up. I never know what the right thing is to do. So the two of us made a decision. Uh, Mario, get, get the out. hell out of here. What? I have a phone number you can call. What are you saying? Uh, we just don't want to see you no more. And you just can't live here no more. Yeah. Uh, what about Aunt Lobo? Does she agree? No, he, she doesn't care. She's done for the day. She, she really couldn't yeah, take it. Lobo is too angry. You don't want to talk to her. She wants to, like, burn you or something. And she's throwing stuff in the other room. Oh, boy. I got fired. Frank, I want you to tell me face to face. Can I still stay here? No! No more exceptions! But I don't have anywhere to go. Well, look, I'm gonna let you off on the staircase, and you knock on every door, and I have a note for you, and whoever, <laughs> whoever, whoever answers the door, man, you know my I'm such a loser. <laughs> Are you really kicking me out? Yes. But it's so cold out. And what does this sign say? What does the sign say? I can't read it. Uh, it says you're a good boy. Oh. Okay. Maybe somebody will pick me up outside and bring me to a nice place, right? Um, go. Please don't. Well, go to every. Well, go to um. Uh, go to every apartment that you find and knock on the, every door and whoever answers will be a new mommy and dad. No, please don't do this, Uncle Frank, please. Sorry, I'm going. Bye. It's so cold out.